What's up guys? Lynn's here from She Cooler Girl. Thanks for checking out my channel. Today I am so excited to show you guys um, how to get these no heat curls using a lava lava or you can call it sarong. Uh, it just depends on where you come from. But this is what you see hula girls wear around their hips. I'm going to show you how to use this to get these. And I actually saw this tutorial on Beauty K Love's channel and she actually uses a scarf. And I was like, oh, oh. I really wear scarves. But I really liked how her curls came out and I was like, I really want to try that out on my hair because she has really long, straight, pretty, luscious hair and mine is not so mm, straight and sleek and yeah, mine is a lot more frizzy and also naturally curly and just the texture, mine is not silky, I wish it were but it's not. And I was like, I'm going to try this. You know, I thought, like, what do I have in my house that could be similar to using a scarf? And then I was like, oh, ding, my sarongs or my lava lavas. I just call them lava lava. I tested it out, and this is how it turned out on my hair. And I really like it. I thought it was really fun. I am excited to show you guys how to do this. And I also did it on my daughter and it looked really cute. And I'll probably put in some pictures at the end or something. So let's get started. So here I have, this one is my full size Lava Lava. It's that big. And this is obviously my half size. Depending on which one you have, which one you want to cut up, grab it. And if you have the full size sarong or lava lava, what you're going to do is just cut it vertically in half. So just cut it boop, all the way down. And then if you have just the half size, just cut, what I did is cut it into four sections. So one, two, three, four. And I cut it all the way down, the whole sarong, lava lava. And if you have shorter hair, but because that's what I do for my long hair, if you have shorter hair, you can do it horizontally, just cut it this way. I only do four just because I don't want too many curls on my head. So it's up to you really what you would like to do, but it's super easy. And same with a scarf, just take your scarf and cut it into four sections. If you guys have any questions, just put it in the comment section down below and I'll do my best to answer them. Go ahead and cut your lava lava into sections and I'll see you guys in a minute. Okay, so... First, you're gonna take your, your lava lava or sarong. So after you cut your sarong or lava lava in four pieces, you can cut it shorter, you could just cut these in half. Do that so I have it in four pieces. And then just grab a section and this one, I'll take a little bit smaller piece of hair. Just so you guys can see what it looks like when you take a little bit smaller piece of um, section of hair versus a bigger section. So just take your bottle of water and you want to dampen your hair. And just brush through it. Grab your piece, your little section of scarf or sarong position where you would like your curl to start. So I'm just going to do mine a little bit lower. Let's see, show you guys what it will look like. So just tie it like that. And then what you're going to do is just wrap your hair around this piece of fabric. So you can go towards your face or you can go 
away. So I'm gonna do it, I choose to do my curls away from my face. Just start twisting your hair around your scarf or lava lava. And just keep going. What you do is just twist it and you're gonna twist it into a bun. So twist, twist, and then you're gonna keep going until you're out of fabric and you can't twist anymore. So twist it. And you're gonna look like a lovely Princess Leia. And that is it. You don't need to put any bobby pins in. That is gonna act as your your bobby pin and just stay in there. Now I'm gonna grab a bigger section. Okay, so grab your water, spritz your hair so it's damp. Grab your piece of fabric and so grab your hair and your fabric, tie it. Like so. Okay. And wrap it away from your face or towards your face, depending on which way you want your curls to go. All right. Now we are just going to twist it into a bun. And now you look adorable. So now you're just gonna wait for a couple of hours or I've slept on it like this before. It's not the most comfortable, but if you just have to get up early in the morning and don't wanna have to worry about your hair too much, then totally just throw, you know, roll your hair up like this after you get out of the shower and then just go to sleep and then in the morning, you know, it might be a little bit frizzy after sleeping, sleeping on it, but just take some serum and put it in your hair and smooth those frizzies down. So I will be back after a couple of hours. <sighs> so I said I was gonna be back in a couple hours, but I ended up falling asleep and I woke up and I was like, <laughs> what time is it? So. <laughs> I just decided to just keep my curls in overnight. You guys are going to see what it's going to look like. I slept in them last night and so just grab your fabric, your scarf or your lava lava and just unwrap it. So I'm just going to take out all the rest of the, the thicker piece of hair, what it looks like after taking it out. And then this is a, the smaller piece and just kind of pull it gently rather than brushing through it. guys I hope you enjoyed that tutorial I hope you guys enjoyed that tutorial and I hope you guys try these curls out if you liked this video please give it a thumbs up 
and don't forget to subscribe so you can see some more of this and yeah so thank you guys so much and I will see you next time bye